Hi, so today we're going to be talking about how to mount an external hard drive to an Acer Iconia A500 tablet. And um, the first thing I want to tell you is that this is for rooted tablets only. So I know a number of people are looking for ways to do this on non-rooted tablets. Um, and at the moment, that's not possible. So the first thing that you need to do is download an application. And I will put this uh, a link for this in the mar to the market. Uh, within the description of this video, but this application is called I'll bring it up here for you to drive mount and if you can see here um, Drive mount is installed by default on some custom ROMs. I have a custom ROM running right now But you can also download it from the market and like I said that link will be in the description But so what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to show you how to use this tool to mount a hard drive It's actually very simple so what I'm going to do now is I'm actually plugging the hard drive into the USB port of my uh, Acer tablet here. And now that that's plugged in, you're going to open up Drive Mail. And I'm going to try to do this slowly because the screencast to the computer here is, uh, is not exactly real time, it's a little laggy. Uh, which by the way, if you want to find out how to screencast your tablet or your phone to a computer, uh, check out the other uh, video that I made on how to do that. It's a step-by-step -step guide. It's pretty simple. Um, so as you can see here, the drive uh, program recognizes the SDA1 NTFS drive that I have attached, and it's a 500 gigabyte drive. So what you're going to do is you're going to select that drive. And then you can see I selected it there. And then over at the top right, you can see the little check you're going to click that. And it's going to attempt to mount the drive. And it's going to grant super user permissions again. Which, by the way, if something pops up asking for super user permissions, make sure you grant the permissions to it. Okay, and if it doesn't show up right away, I just click the refresh button there. Uh, you can see that now the hard drive is attached under Mount SDA1. So if you go back to your home screen, and I've downloaded a program called Astro File Manager. It's a really nice program. Um, and I'm going to show you that it did attach it here. If you go to File Manager on this, you'll see that under Mount, if you go up a level, you'll see that we have SDA one right here. So if we click on that, you can actually browse. These are all the files that are stored on my hard drive. So this is an external hard drive being plugged into the tablet, and you can actually access and edit files that are stored on that hard drive. Okay. So if we go back to our uh, mount program, I'm going to show you how to unmount the drive here also pretty simple. If you click on the hard drive that's listed there, and then you click on the little X up here in the corner, it's going to unmount the hard drive. And it'll put it back under the unmounted drives list. So that's really all there is to it. Uh, if you have any questions, be sure to leave a comment.